Miss Inheimer, lacrosse alumni from the last four decades and their families were on hand on Saturday to commemorate the 40th anniversary of men's lacrosse at Pfeiffer University and celebrate the renaming of the newly renovated soccer and lacrosse competition field as Lefko Mills Field. The special announcement regarding the new field name was made ahead of the Pfeiffer men's lacrosse victory over Piedmont University. A dedication and public recognition of donors to the project is planned as a part of the homecoming game day schedule on October 19, 2024. The venue, which was recently upgraded with a state-of-the-art artificial turf surface, was originally named after longtime head soccer coach Nicholas E. Lefko 37, who coached at FIFA from 1959-74 and was enshrined as a charter member of the FIFA Sports Hall of Fame in 1990. He also was inducted into the Nia Hall of Fame in 1979. Lefka coached three All-Americans and guided his 1965 team to a 10-1 overall record, leading them to a national ranking. Lefko would serve at Pfeiffer as a coach and professor for 42 years. Randolph P. Mills Jr. served as a lacrosse assistant coach and was instrumental in recruiting many of the players who were ultimately the foundation of the Pfeiffer men's lacrosse program in the mid-1980s. Mills used his connections in the northeastern part of the country to recruit talented players to the program. Known as the Johnny Appleseed of lacrosse, Mills founded programs at Pfeiffer University, Limestone University, Neumann University, and Cabrini College. He also started club teams and recreation programs at Gardner Webb University and UCLA among many others. In 1996, Mills was named Man of the Year by the Pennsylvania Coaches Association and was subsequently recognized by the NCAA for having the highest winning percentage in Division III. Prior to the game, FIFA president Dr. Scott Bullard spoke to those in attendance, recognizing the importance of athletics to the overall student experience at FIFA and thanking lacrosse alumni, soccer alumni and friends of the university who have provided financial support to make the installation of an artificial turf surface a reality. Bullard noted that the new field name recognizes two central figures in FIFA's outstanding soccer and lacrosse history. Tom Mills 86, a Fife lacrosse alumnus and son of coach Randy Mills, also thanked donors to the field upgrade for their generosity, reminding the crowd that the early teams played over there in that patch of grass and dirt, referring to what is now a practice field. All teams that use this field, from the men's and women's lacrosse teams, both soccer programs, the track and field program, as well as the general student body have something to be proud of, he said. With the addition of this beautiful turf field that stands next to our excellent softball facility, FIFA is continuing its resurgence, and we are all happy and proud to be a part of it.